Well, examiner today confirmed information we first reported about a gruesome discovery back in May. A body found in a sewer at 40th and Garfield had been dismembered. Jermon Terry is live with the latest on that story. Jermon? Mike and Carol, for weeks, people have wondered who was found inside this north side sewer and exactly how the man died. The medical examiner's report shows that someone used an unknown tool and chopped off several body parts, but we still don't know who this man is. May 30th, 2012, the Washington Park neighborhood is horrified. Shocked. Shocked to hear there's all this going on over here because there's so much been happening, but you never think a body would be on the ground. But that's exactly what the DPW crew discovered that day near 40th and Garfield. But that's sad. That's very, very sad. That morning, the DPW workers came to the alley to clean the catch basin. That's where the body parts were first spotted. Once they removed the 50 pound grate, they looked down to the catch basin, which is about 8 to 10 feet below the street. There, they found the dismembered body parts floating in water infested with maggots. Why would somebody cut somebody's body parts off anyways? Is that serious, you know? The report says the head, hands, feet, and thighs were all severed, and the torso and pelvis of the unknown black man was never found. Very gruesome to me. Then it's sad to just to do another person like that. It leaves neighbors like Brenda Gibbs to reflect. I would have been shocked if I would have been the one that found it. I had a chance to talk to the crew who found the body. They tell me they can't get the image out of their minds, but they hope the man is identified at some point. And if they can't, they're just going to be a lost person in this world. Just one this, this memory person that, you know, we don't know. Now, we do want to point out that the medical examiner's report tried to get a fingerprint from the body parts that were found in the sewer. They, however, they did not come up with any type of match. So tonight, months later, weeks later, is still a mystery as to who this individual is. Of course, police are asking anyone if they have any information to give them a call. On your side, live at 40th and Garfield, Jermont Terry, today's TMJ4. So gruesome, mm -hmm. hard to imagine. Thank you very much, Jermont.